Hello everybody, welcome to That's Football. It's Portugal against France. It's our second quarter-final. The winner will play Spain. Um, how are we all doing? I've just spent the time watching that uh, Spain game, probably with some of you, and uh, I think it lived up to... It's not about how it starts, it's about how it ends. That's what she said, and uh, she was right. Um, very, very, very good game of football um, at the end there, and... Um, yeah, look, I think that it's always interesting when you don't really have a horse in the race and you feel for both, you know, you feel for the loser. I feel for Germany. I think it was always going to be a loss to um, to to the tournament to lose the hosts. And I think they went out in a game where they could have won it. And I think if Spain had gone out, it would have been sad to, do, to, you, to lose them as well uh, in a game that they could have won as well. So, look, that's I, I feel that that could have been the final. Um, and there's not a lot you can do about it. I definitely feel there's a good tempo to this game. It just desperately needs a goal. Camavinga shoots over the bar. Free kick here. Oh, fucking hell. I can't stand Portugal free kicks. I'm sorry. I can't. I don't even want to watch this. Every Portugal free kick, even if it's in their own penalty box, he shoots. I love Ronaldo. I love Ronaldo. But... I can't stand this waste of time taking the free kick from everywhere. I mean, the, 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 you shouldn't even shoot here. Most goals in, in this tournament have been scored from crosses. Put a bloody cross in. That's just a bloody waste of time. And you know, it takes him about a minute to take the free kick as well. Over the fucking about waste of time. It's just a waste of time. And he didn't take it. Bruno did. Um... Yeah, nowhere near. You, 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 I just don't think you beat goalkeepers from that distance anymore. It's too far out. Uh, Hussein, welcome to the Members Club. You're a legend. What do you think about the Polish team, says Org. Uh, I find them quite boring to watch. Uh, Daniel says, for Portugal to be su successful, they've got to remove Ronaldo away from Saliba. Saliba is just too good uh, target up Meccano and Flo. Uh, yeah, I mean, Daniel, uh, uh, there was a point about five minutes ago where there was a nice ball into the channel and Saliba just jogged there, won the ball, pushed Ronaldo off and, yeah, it's a problem. And I'm not saying they've got anybody on the bench that could do a better job, but when you're up against people like Saliba and you're knocking balls in the channel for Ronaldo, you know, he's got a cigar on. That's a goal. Oh, why is uh, why is Moani not gambling on that? Yeah, I put a tweet out. Um, I love Ronaldo, but I'd seriously be considering taking him off because you've got to look at tactics, right? And if you had two slow centre backs against a quick striker, you've got to get a quick centre back on, haven't you? Because you're going to get dominated. Well, it works the other way. They've got two quick, strong centre-backs against Ronaldo. And he's just not doing anything. And at what point does it become a vanity project? Do you want to win the tournament? Because he's just not making any impact at all. Against that quality of a centre-back. Um realize this is as sad as it is viva ronaldo says joe well it's funny when the tournament started i actually predicted that um that ronaldo would win the golden boot um and i genuinely thought he might but you know i also thought him and messi might play at the World Cup in America because Messi and Ronaldo, big, you know, fanfare of the American World Cup. I think it's going to be, I think it's going to be beyond Ronaldo from what I've seen in this tournament. I mean, he's still ridiculously fit, but, you know, into Liao. I feel Portugal might get a goal. Great save. Oh, my God. Menon is absolutely having a worldie here. Menion is keeping France alive. 
Fatina should score there. I was just saying that Portugal seemed to be a bit on top. He should score there. I mean, great save, but he should score. I tell you what, if there's one team that knows how to shit house their way to a tournament. Oh, what a save by Costa. These keepers, mate. These keepers are having worldies. Moani, he loves him. Well, it wasn't Moani. It was it was um, it was Diaz. It was going wide anyway, surely. Moani in a one on one. I tell you what, if you're drowning and Moani's throwing you the life ring, you may as well just go under. He's missing. Oh, what a chance for Kama... There was Kamavinga. How's he put it wide from that side of the goal? Big chance. And he's missed. And that's got to be the chance of the game. Look, Dembele making the chance. Kamavinga from there. I mean, to be fair, the keeper might have closed every angle off. Well, if you go with the left foot, no. Oh, don't shoot from here, Ronaldo. This is a cross every day of the bloody week. He, he, he can't shoot from here. He's having a fucking laugh. It's on the. It's, it's not even on the right side of the pitch. Oh, for fuck's sake, mate! It's bloody embarrassing where he shoots from. I love the guy, but this is just bloody embarrassing. Straight into the bloody what? It's it's it's, it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. Three minutes added on. Fucking hell. Oh, just... Going to sleep. Oh, wake me up when it's over. What a shit game. I hate being right about this. I hate it. Fucking waste of time. Oh, yeah, because Ronaldo's never missed a penalty, mate. And and what about ja what about Ramos? He can probably take a penalty as well. He, then he's not he's not keeping him on for bloody penalties. Oh, for fuck's sake, mate! He's just missed the chance of the game. I can't believe he's missed that. Nunez. Oh, they might score here. Bernardo, slip him in. You greedy bastard. You greedy bastard. Why didn't he slip the guy in in front of him? Here he comes. And he scores. Puts it nicely to the left of Costa who goes the wrong way. Costa made three saves in a row from the first three penalties against Slovenia. But France get off to a good start here. I hope Portugal and England meet at the finals for dramatic story. If no trophy, Kane versus Ronaldo, last international stand, says Harum. Uh, Mark, not used to be, being so harsh on Ronaldo. I, I, mate, I'm not being harsh on Ronaldo. I love Ronaldo, but love is not blind. Like, love is telling the truth. And he should have been taken off. Like, he didn't do anything in that game. Um, I want him to score this penalty more than anything. But watching him take free kicks from the corner flag and shooting, I just think it's become a bit of a vanity project. And he scores. Thank God for that. 1-1. One, one. Oh, the score is doing the penalties. <laughs> brap, brap, brap. There you go. So the, the scores, I, I think the scoreboard has just said, fuck this. It's been such a bad game. We're actually going to score, the, count the penalties as goals. So... Uh, it's a little bit delayed, but um, it will do it. Uh, here comes Fafana. Was it an illegal penalty for Ronaldo? I don't think anybody does anything about that anymore. Come on, Costa. I actually do want Portugal to win now. Fafana. Good penalty down the middle. Ooh! You know what? I've been keeping an eye on that. There is some stats about... The amount of second penalty takers who go down the middle. And there you go. Second penalty down the middle. There is some there is some stat about the second penalty taker going down the middle. Uh, Bernardo Silva did it, didn't he? Against uh, Real Madrid. 
And uh, yeah. Uh, make sure you subscribe, by the way. Loads of people tuning in. England tomorrow. But uh, this is Bernardo Silva. Of course, he missed a big penalty for Man City in the Champions League by going down the middle. He won't go down the middle this time. Ooh, he didn't go down the middle, but it was close to the keeper. But he went with height. And it's very difficult to save a penalty when it's got height on it. Not my words. The words of Ben Foster. Kunde. Good penalty. Very good penalty. And it's getting into danger territory now. It's getting dangerous. You miss now, you probably go out. Good penalty by Kunde. High again. Good technique. Into the corner and high. Very difficult for the goalkeeper to save it when it's when when they put it that high. Great penalty, says just Danny. Do you think this has been a very boring tournament? No, Joshua. I think it's been a really good tournament. I just think there's been a handful of boring games, which unfortunately the big teams have been a party to. Portugal, France, England. Shao Felix is going to miss. Well, yeah, a lot of people saying that in the chat. Not played a lot of football. He has got miss on him. I think he'll score. Fucking missed it. It's the post. Ronaldo's going to be fuming. It's not a good penalty. It's the foot of the post. I think that might be it for Portugal. I think they might be heading home. But you know what? I've got to say that France made a lot of subs and they played shit throughout. Portugal made no attacking subs, really. They left a lot of their attackers on the bench. They left Jota on the bench the whole time. Martinez was right up the arse of certain players. Barcola scores. I think France have this in the bag now. They've got four from four. Portugal need to score this and save the next one. Otherwise, France go through to the semi-final. And Portugal are going to be going out. I think it's going to be very difficult now. Very, very difficult now. Og says, I think it's over. Villa for life says, Portugal will still win this. Subs always miss, says Shahin. Always. Well, we remember that with England, don't we? Sancho, Rashford, both came off the bench late in the final. Both scored. I mean... Fourth penalty taker is Mendes. That that just shows you the crap subs that Martinez has made. That he's got lots of attackers who he, who aren't even on the pitch. He could have brought Jota and Ramos on. It's a good penalty by Mendes. You're never going to save that. Left footer, isn't he? Is he a left footer? I think he is. Hard to save a left footer. I'll predict which way this is going to go based on his run up. Mbappe's excited. I think he might. He's going to hook it, I think. I think he's going to do exactly what Mendes did. I think he's going to go to Costa's left. No, what a penalty. Even I didn't get that. I'll say the same thing I would have said with both. Fucking rubbish. I mean, I really hope Spain beat them. But, I mean, is there is there a victor in that game? I don't know. Um... I'd, I'd kick both out. Score Bridge, that's the end of the clip. I'm sure you enjoyed it. In fact, I bet that's the best clip you've ever watched. So there's no reason not to subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon so you never miss a clip again. In fact, smash a like on the video because we all know only legends like videos and you are all legends. So please smash a like on the video and uh, we will see you again on the next one. Thank you very much for watching as always.